Meanwhile, an executive of Formosa Oil Seed Processing held a press conference today to deny allegations against his company. Chief Financial Officer Chen Shi Zhang says his company had no idea that the oil it bought from Jiangxi Foodstuff Factory was cheap cottonseed oil and not olive oil as labeled. He also denied insider trading allegations after a bumpy trading day last week. The reputation of Formosa oil seed processing suffered when six edible oil products were shown to be adulterated. Two of the products blended in inferior oil produced by Changchi Foodstuff Factory, the company at the center of the edible oil scandal. The Ministry of Health and Welfare already ordered Formosa oil seed processing to recall all six products. And today, the company's chief financial officer went a step further. He announced a company will pull out of the home use oil market. For six years, Formosa Oil Seed purchased oil from Changchi. It said it tested the products but never found any problems. Generally, we only bought packaged olive oil from Changchi, and it passed all tests before we accepted it. In this area, our operations manager will cooperate with investigators and prosecutors. Last week, one day before Formosa Oil Seed provided an affidavit to health authorities guaranteeing its labels were accurate, trade in its shares were unusually heavy. Investors suspect insider trading could have occurred, a charge the CFO denied. It was just market conditions. Internally, our company doesn't know anything about this. If investors have suspicions, I think that overseeing agencies can go investigate. Our company will cooperate. Formosa Oil Seed also guarantees refunds on affected products and has raised its guarantee funds from $8 million NT dollars to $20 million.